hydroxy chloroquine a medicine that india has shipped to multiple countries to help fight covid-19 as per reports approximately 35.82 lakh tablets have been sent to the us alone let's find out why countries are requesting a drug used to treat malaria and how india has become a pharmacy of the world hydroxychloroquine was first used in world war 2 to keep us soldiers safe from malaria in southeast asia it is used in treating the viral mosquito borne disease to reduce fever and inflammation at the time of india's independence there were 75 million cases of malaria in a population of 330 million hydroxychloroquine helped get the number down to 100000 but the question remains why has it even been considered as a possible treatment for the coronavirus Researchers in France and China used a combination of HCQ and azithromycin on patients of coronavirus as an experimental treatment. As it turns out, these patients responded well. However, these trials were small, did not use proper control groups and weren't up to international standards. Thus, there is very little scientific evidence to prove that HCQ is an effective treatment for COVID-19. We need larger, high-quality randomized clinical trials in order to better evaluate their effectiveness, says the University of Oxford's Combe Binigi. Another reason the drug has been considered for COVID-19 patients is that it can rein in an overactive immune system, which is why it is used to treat lupus and rheumatoid arthritis. In severe cases of COVID-19, the immune system seems to go into overdrive, causing inflammation that can damage organs. Doctors hope HCQ might calm the condition, sometimes called a cytokine storm. But again, there is no proof that it has that effect. That said, many hospitals are giving it to patients because there is no proven treatment and they hope it will help. Additionally, clinical trials with control groups have begun across the world. Much of this is happening due to the consignments of HCQ tablets sent by India. But there's one question we have all been asking. Does India have enough HCQ for itself? Here's what Damu Ravi, the Joint Secretary in the Ministry of External Affairs said, taking into view domestic stock and requirements while keeping a sufficient buffer, a decision was taken to release surplus medicine for export. The Ministry of Health and Family Welfare also stated that the country has 3.28 crore tablets in stock, with domestic needs being 1 crore tablets. That said, here is the most important piece of information about HCQ. Self-medication needs to be strictly avoided. Like every drug, HCQ can have side effects. It is not safe for people who have abnormalities in their heart rhythms, eye problems involving the retina, or liver or kidney disease. In fact, if you take too much of it, it can kill you. Plus, there is no proof that it is an effective treatment or preventive measure for COVID-19. And if HCQ is being sold on the street or via the internet, it may be fake or unsafe. At this point, the best way to avoid infection is to practice the social distancing and quarantine measures recommended by public health authorities. 